Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Thursday, the 10th of December. I'm James Spann. Many spots around 70 today. Similar weather tomorrow. Then we'll deal with some rain at times over the weekend. And next week will be colder. Let's dive into it. Here's the upper air look across the country this afternoon. Got a trough in the southwestern states beginning to lift out. That will bring the chance of showers on Saturday. But today, really nice. Again, a cloudless sky all across the deep south. And look at there, we've got some low 70s on the board. 71 for Tuscaloosa, Birmingham, and Anniston. 72 for Utah. 73 at Demopolis. We'll see similar numbers tomorrow. There's the watch warning map. Pretty quiet day. We've got some scattered winter weather issues for the western half of the country. Here's the severe weather outlook through tonight. There could be some thunder for parts of Texas and the southwest, but no severe weather expected. Then tomorrow, a marginal risk over East Texas up into the Arklatex region, back up toward Little Rock. And then Saturday, day three, no severe weather expected. There might be a rumble of thunder somewhere in Alabama. This is the rain for the next seven days. Again, the big numbers, the upper Pacific coast for Alabama. The amounts for most locations, about a half inch, and this is valid between now and Thursday morning of next week. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the 12Z run valid tomorrow at three. The trough is lifting out of the southwest. Rain and thunderstorms likely from Missouri down through parts of Arkansas and East Texas. But for us in Alabama, another dry, mild day. The high should be close to 70, the sky partially sunny. Saturday got a surface low east of Chicago with a trailing front, but there's very little moisture to work with, very little instability. This is the high-res NAM at noon Saturday, and it's basically got nothing more than a fairly narrow band of showers from near Chattanooga down to Birmingham and Washington County in southwest Alabama. So if this verifies, really a decent part of the day Saturday could be dry with one band of showers coming through during the midday hours. Otherwise, Saturday will be cloudy with a high in the 60s. And then Sunday, that feature is on by. The day Sunday should be dry. Maybe some sun early in the day. Uh, the high should be in the upper 50s, but clouds will increase by afternoon. And the next wave comes in here Sunday night. And quite frankly, of the two, uh, the event Saturday and the event Sunday night, this might bring more rain. The rain should be more widespread. It's going to be a cool rain, no chance of any severe weather. And the thickness value suggests no chance of any snow, just a cool rain falling Sunday night. And then Monday, the feature is on by. Uh, the sky becoming sunny. The high will be in the 50s. This is Tuesday. We'll call it partly sunny, and again, we'll leave it dry for now. This is Tuesday night at midnight, a little wave passing just north of the state. That might squeeze out some light rain for the northern third of the state. Tuesday night or Wednesday morning, probably not much. And then during the day Wednesday, any lingering rain ending during the morning, and we turn noticeably colder. In fact, uh, we'll be in the 40s. Thickness values come way down. We'll be in the 40s all day Wednesday, sharply colder. And this is a week from today, Thursday the 17th, a zonal flow and a cool, dry air mass in place. Let's go out 10 days. This is Sunday, December 20th. Pretty good trough passing through, a surface low that's over Kentucky and a trailing band of showers and storms. And again, this is Sunday, December 20th, but we all know this could change. This is 10 days out. Check the snow for Birmingham, the European Ensemble. Only one member out of 50 showing a few snowflakes uh, middle of next week, and obviously snow is not going to be an issue here anytime soon. This carries us all the way through Christmas Day. Rain for Birmingham through Christmas, the mean between 2 and 3 inches, some of the members exceeding 5 inches. And temperatures, you can see the numbers coming down next week. Again, I think Wednesday will be in the 40s all day, but pretty cool with the highs in the 50s and lows in the 30s. Pretty seasonal, if you will. And hot off the presses, the brand new CPC outlook. This is for December 18th through the 24th, approaching Christmas. And again, if this verifies, temperatures here would be above average. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. If you can't catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening and God bless. There are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more.